Yo guys and girls, what's up? Welcome back to another live stream. <clears throat> so yesterday they landed us with some new baits. That's the plan today to work out if these baits are any good or not. <clears throat> I've not tried them yet. Do excuse me. <coughs> wow. What we're going to do is we're just going to uh, click on the control room. I've just got a couple of bits to do guys. You know the score uh, before I can really sort of get going what i'll do is i'll quickly show you the tackle box that's the setup i'm using i'm using a 15 pound called a braid i will get to your comments in a second guys just bear with me go to the watch page make sure the volume's okay hang on it's very quiet yo guys welcome wow lots of people in awesome that's what i like to see i will get back to you in a second just bear with me right awesome so i just had to check the volume make sure <coughs> you guys could hear me okay uh da, 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 da. they've changed the layout on youtube and i can't actually work out what's going on <laughs> right we'll just go to here go to here select that save right. I was going to put all the tags and that in but I don't think I'll bother putting the tags in right so this is the setup I'm using I'll say it again I'm using the 15 pound braid um, <clears throat> the reason I'm going to go with the 15 pound braid is I want to go back to digger lakes now the reason I want to go to digger lakes is I've got three fish that have just absolutely Failed so much. Oh, yeah, whatever. I mean, advanced setting. Jobs are good. Un. Du, 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 du. Save. All saved. Yep, right. Brilliant. Sorry about this, guys. I can't actually do this. We'll do that after. Um, make sure the quality stays good for you guys. Right. Let's have a quick hello to everyone. <coughs> okay. Slicks the 77 says hi long time no see yo nwg yo big timer j is in the house welcome big timer everyone go take check out big timer j's channel absolutely awesome channel and check the link to his facebook group which is awesome land rascal hi big bug tyler what what do you think of fishing planet big bug i think fishing planet's okay it's a bit complex in places um but pff, there you go. I've just put a video out on it how to navigate the menus. Elite Hydro says hi. Joe says hi. Dippy Doorknob, yo. Hey, big bug, bruh. Unknown Gamer, hi. <coughs> Guys, welcome everybody, first of all. I just want to say that. Right, let's get cracking. So, the new baits are Atlantic Heat 15 mil. The Royal Marine 18mm, the Liver Pro 16mm, and the TNT 18mm. <coughs> now, they're all sink baits, that's the problem. So, really, what I need to do is drop one of them for a, a buoyant bait. Let's drop the. La la la. Let's drop. I like the TNT because that's Toffee and Tiger Nut. I like the liver, but right, let's drop the liver bait. And we'll put in a good old traditional mainline 15 mil, I think. That'll give us a bit of a, a pop-up. So, just in case, guys. That's all that is, just in case. Right, so in the tackle shop, guys, I'll quickly show you the new baits are located in the carp section. So, if you go towards the carp uh, bottom left-hand corner, and they're along here. This is where they've been added. You can read all about them baits there. Uh, quickly show you the profile. Here's what I'm after. Digger. Right. So, I'm after Platy, The Bruiser. And Baby M. They're the ones I'm after. St. John's Lake now. I've only got two fish to get. Which are both the big cats. Uh... Presa del Monte Bravo, I'm not going to fish that today, but I've got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 
one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine fish to catch on that. <clears throat> and the foundry, I've caught them all. Um, observatory, I've literally never fished. I think I've fished it twice, and I caught two boss fish. Maybe I'll go back there, maybe not. And the same with uh, La Arena, or however you pronounce that. Basically, fished it once, caught a boss fish, was more than happy with that. Right, um go back I'll quickly show you my profile <clears throat> there's the profile guys I just caught big plated nice one my friend I love your streams thank you Luke your stuff fire rat is in the house what's up bud how's it going awesome my friend I hope you're keeping well I caught it the other day nice one elite hydro Leighton Kamara I've been fishing in real life yesterday caught a 22 pound nice at raker lakes in york very nice my friend well done so i've had 179 boss fish 111 of those have been lost they're from uh, previous things as you can see down the bottom there it's got bream carp catfish roach and tench the carp is on there as 93 pound eight we know that's not the case it's one from the uh, uh foundry i think it's meant to be a 43 pound oh don't know what i'm doing here that's meant to be a 43 pounder. Obviously, we know that's not the case. We're going to go to Digger Lakes, guys. That's the order of the day. I'm going to put it on a long day. I'm going to put the weather conditions to light clouds, the wind to static, and tackle box 2, which is the one I've just shown you. Let's uh, whack it out. There it is, guys. Coming soon. Manor Farm Lake. 14 acres in size, over 700 carp, quality roach, bream tench cats. 20, 23 new boss fish can't wait guys can't wait and 10 new trophies so hopefully that'll be with us soon um that'll be really good i love the way that falling tree looks looks into the lake right so this is digger lakes i'm basically going to pick this top uh bottom right hand side and i'm going to fish one of those two swims over there let's get over there if everyone could just uh, press that thumbs up or thumbs down, whatever you prefer, I'd really appreciate that. Right, let's quickly get round to the swim and then I can get set up and we can get some comments read. Now, I'm not going to fish the first swim. I'm going to fish the second. Um, how you doing, bud? New baits are sick. Awesome. Can you mention my name, big fan? Leighton Cam... Cam Camera, is that camera? No problem, my friend. There you go. Apologies if I butchered your name. Welcome to the stream, everybody. I really appreciate that. What's up, Big Bug? Um, good Wayne, thank you, Wayne Fleming. Nice one. Channels, hello, Fisher Master. <laughs> oh, I don't know about that, dude. <laughs> We just do what we do right infantry so let's start on i want to try these new baits guys so really and truthfully i need to be in the silt um we'll put a size six kd rig on with the atlantic heat sounds good sounds good rod two we're gonna put we'll go a size six royal marine i like the sound of that sounds good Let's do that. And rod three. We're going to go... The TNT. Got a feeling that TNT is going to be my bait. Again, these are all on size 6 KD rigs, guys. I'm going to have a little cast around. It's been a little while since I've been in this swim, if I'm honest. Oh, uh, I think I might have gone a bit overkill there. Right, a bit carried away. See? getting excited had a few big ones on them last night i think royal marine are the best awesome right well let's have a have a little crack at it and see where we're at a little bit of silt there apparently they've sorted the baits out from moving so that'll be really good looks like it's bobbling around a little bit i think rod 2 was royal marine wasn't it if i remember rightly let's cast this one out now, although the, the graphics on Fishing Planet are better than this, uh, I do prefer the gameplay on this. I'm not going to lie. For me, personally. 
Now, I usually like to fish into the lily pads, if I'm honest, on this swim. <coughs> but I've not, I'm not using a buoyant bait. I'm using sink bait, so I need to stay round about the silt. Just tighten that down. We need to tighten that rod too. Just give that a little tighten. Nice. Right, the rods are out, guys. Epic. Now we can read some... Uh, my personal best in real life is £45. Very nice. I just caught a £39 catfish on Fishing Planet. Awesome. Small bug 33. Yo. Put liver pro on. Caught baby M. Very nice. I saw your message today. <clears throat> is Fishing Planet on Xbox? I understand, Joe, that Fishing Planet is coming to Xbox. But it's not on there yet. Tighten that up. I've brought that a lot closer than that. Wow. I thought they'd stopped all that. That was moving quite a lot, wasn't it? Okay. We'll see how we get on anyway. I'm not happy with them two rods, if I'm honest. They're kind of uh, wandering around a little bit. Let's give that a little cast. I think I've done that a bit hard, guys. I've got a feeling that's going to the other bank. Oh, no. It's there. Right. Let it sink. It's in two foot of water over there. I quite like that. We'll put that down. Let's sort this second rod out. I'm not happy with the rod. The rods have got to be right, guys. If I'm going to sit with these rods here, it's got to be right. Now, I know if I was to put a chod rig on and chuck them into the middle of the lilies, I would catch fish. But, I want to try these new baits out. Let's give that a second to settle. There we go. Right, awesome. Do you think boss fish are harder to catch than before? <clears throat> um, yes and no. It really does depend. Oh. I personally, touch wood, as yet, haven't struggled uh, with the fishing. But I understand a lot of people have, if that makes sense. So, I fished on it. I've done a video the other day on Digger Lakes. And it literally took me sort of 40 minutes to catch three boss fish. And capture the footage that I needed for the video. Yes, this is fighting well. I don't think it's a boss though. It's just giving a good account for itself. I'm only on £15 line guys, remember that. I didn't come on with the, the big £25 bride. I'm only on the £15. Come on, out you come. Come on. Get out. Nice. Just managed to stop him running around that corner. Fighting well. It's probably a little one. The little ones on here seem to fight a, a lot harder than some of the big ones, if I'm honest. Um... I've not tried Prezza for a while, so I'm not sure how hard the boss fish are there to catch. Uh, recently, I mean. Nice, he's in the net. Get in the net. <laughs> awesome. Irish Gaming Streaming Channel. Yo, donates £2. Well done, my friend. Thank you so much for that. That is awesome. Donates £2 on the Super Chat. I really do appreciate that, Irish Gaming Streaming. Um, everyone, go check his channel out. He does a lot of Dead by Daylight. Really cool uh, streamer. And gets gets right into the game. Um, anyone that hasn't seen that game needs to go and see it. Um, very, very good. Very funny. I really do appreciate that donation, my friend. Thank you so much. You're an absolute star. Caught new PB, £11 carp. Nice, very nice. CFC says hi. Welcome, my friend. Do you think boss fish are harder to catch? We've gone through that one. Would you like to see Legends Lake added at some point with Clarissa Two-Tone and so on? <clears throat> Why not, Wayne? I mean, I'm up for all that. Definitely. Any any lake with the, the good old traditional carping, you know? The really sought after carp in this country is definitely welcoming my book. I can't keep these lines tight, guys. Oh, easy now. 
Here we go. Whoa, that feels all right. Feels quite heavy, that. <clears throat> Carrizo Jones says, yo, or hello. What do you think about the new baits? I'm just trying them for the first time, CFC. So I will let you know for sure. Um, I mean, ho hopefully they're good. That's what I'm kind of thinking. Uh, the main thing for me was I, I was hoping Dovetail have sorted out the whole rigs moving across the lake. Because uh, that was, although it didn't really affect the game, it was just annoying. Feels good. Doesn't feel massive. Not as big as I thought it was going to be first off. I thought it was going to be a lot bigger. <clears throat> awesome. Danny9541 says, hi. Who won the Euro fishing t-shirt? It was a guy. Look at that. I never caught one like that before. <clears throat> that's, a, that's a different fish. I've not caught. Now, I've caught loads of them linear, but usually they're quite bright. But that one's got like different color tones to it. Oh, that's definitely new. That is definitely new added to the game, that one, without a doubt. Um, it was a guy called, <coughs> or a young and called, Harley. Harley the Duck. <laughs> so, Harley the Duck won the t shirt. Well done to him. All right. Now, I was impressed with that last fish, guys. I don't know if you saw it. But the colours of it, it's awesome game, dude. I tried TNT out last night. Don't think it was that good. Just out of five pound tench, nice. Um, I've got no. I didn't use TNT today. I dropped TNT for a pop-up bait. So we'll see what that what happens there. I have noticed this rod too is coming back towards me a little bit. I'm just gonna fire that back out. Bring it through the reeds or lily pads. Here we go. Hopefully that will stay tight. That would be nice if it does. Right, that one's moved into the weed. See if we can get that just over the back of that lily pad. Oh, it hit the clip. Didn't even realise I'd clipped it up. Here we go. Right. <coughs> okay, so a couple of little carp to start. There's TNT, <laughs> says Brother Bobby. Welcome to the stream, my friend. Thank you for tuning in. Everyone go check out Brother Bobby's channel. Awesome channel. Awesome guy. Really good streamer. Uh, Brother Bobby, TNT on this game is a boily bait called tiger, um, Toffee and Tiger Nut. Is what it is. It's the flavour of the, the bait, if you like, or the scent of the bait. Feels, feels decent. Could be a, a good fish, yeah. No, no, it's quite lively, so not too sure about this one. TNT could make this game quite interesting, brother Bobby. To be fair, bit of the old dynamite fishing going on. Hi, friend, what is the new bait? So, you, the new baits are Atlantic Heat, which is um. Obviously, like a fish meal base boilie with spice. Uh, you've got the Royal Marine. Um, I can't remember what was in it, so you'll have to check that out. Um, you've got TNT, which is toffee and tiger nut. And you've got... Uh, da, 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 da. I can't remember the name of the new one. These are definitely different fish. Yo, just come in to stream, say hi, and good session, mate. Bye, chat. Thank you, Irish uh, Gaming Streaming Channel. That is absolutely awesome. Thank you for the donation on Super Chat, my friend. You're an absolute star. Everyone go check out uh, Irish Gaming's channel. I would really appreciate it. Even if you just drop into the comments and just put hi from Big Bugs channel, whatever you like, uh, go hit the like on the, the man's latest video, give the man a, a boost, that would be really cool, oh, that makes more sense, <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah, not actual TNT, my friend, not actual TNT, 
The game does feel like it's playing a little bit harder, if I'm honest. I know we've had a few fish, guys. A couple of carp. I love the colour of them carp. I've, they're definitely new. Can someone confirm that at all? Or, oh, I've left it in the weed. I didn't want that. Didn't want it in the weed. Oh, oh god damn. Come on, pick it up. Let's go. If you guys could hit that like for me, I'd really appreciate that. If you're new around here, then why not subscribe? Also, I have the game so I can play with you and thank. Yeah, awesome, dude. Adam, welcome to the stream. Savage Emperor. Black and ship. Hey, buddy, how we doing? I'm all good, my friend. Thank you. I love your vids. Thank you, Callum Reeves. You're an absolute star. I love the streaming, so like and sub. You are the best. Thank you very much, my friend. You're an absolute star. Okay, so the rods are out. I'm already thinking about a, a swim change. I've got to be honest. Whoa. We'll see what happens. Whoa. Keep that wall. Keep that line tension down. I'm not quite sure why it keeps resetting to faulty. Um, we'll have to keep an eye on that. They do look like new colours. They definitely do, Big Time Ajay. I agree. They're much more realistic, I think. Um, when they were then bright yellows and things, although they were beautiful and you do get fish like that, they wasn't quite right, if that makes sense. Are you going to get Destiny 2? Probably not, Brother Bobby. I'm not much of a Destiny player. Um... So I'm not sure. What about yourself, mate? You going to be on that Destiny 2? Are you on it? Dylan, love your videos, Big Bug. Do you do much fishing in real life? I do fish in real life. I haven't managed to get out much this year. Um, but I, I do fish a syndicate not far from where I live. Thanks, Bug, for the info. Love you, man. No worries, Dark Howling Wolf. Not a problem. Yes, sir. Brother Bobby's going to be bang on the uh, Destiny 2, guys. He also plays a lot of uh, Overwatch, so go check him out. Will the new map be DLC? Yeah, I've got a feeling we're going to be paying for that, my friend. That will definitely be DLC, I would say. Um, the only uh, faults I had with the Foundry DLC was... An, I don't mean this. I don't want you guys to think badly of me, but I personally felt that it was very easy. Um, I caught 16 boss fish in one night in a three and a half hour session with friends. And you shouldn't be catching boss fish like that. 16 pound 13. Nice. The colours are definitely darker on these fish. That is for sure. Rod one. Tears off. Ah, this feels okay. This feels like a good fish. This don't feel like the other ones did. This has got a bit of a meaning about it, this fish. It feels decent. Could be our first boss fish here, guys. Now, I put the £15 braid on because the biggest fish I'm after is, what, 34 or £36? And I thought it would be a bit of a challenge if I hooked it. So... And I do like to challenge myself on this game a little bit. Uh, the only reason I turn the sort of wind dynamics off and things is for the video to make it a bit more sort of calmer, a bit more pleasant, you know. Please go online, I will play with you. If I go online, I definitely will. Apparently, they've sorted out the multiplayer crashing now, so that could be something I'll explore in the future to get a few people in. That'd be awesome. It will be fun, definitely agree. What's your favourite new bait? Not sure yet, my friend. This is the first um, first time I've used them. Absolutely first time I've used them. So, we'll see what happens here. Uh, so far, Rod 2 has been good. Rod 3 has been good. But we'll see. We'll see what happens. If I have a boss fish, we'll mark down what, what it's on. This feels like a good fish. I'm not going to lie to you, this feels really nice. 
it's probably going to come up as a 12 pounder or a stickleback or something but we'll see what happens <laughs> three pound 12 ounce roach yeah you know that didn't you <laughs> do you have time to play whoa here we go here we go it's in the net it's in the net bug i went roach fishing and i'm after catching a three pound wow there you have it guys this fish has definitely changed color overnight i had this one the other day on a video the half lin has been made a lot sort of more pale uh, with a little fleck of color in the tail there that you can see on the the back wrist of the fish stunning fish first boss fish of the day i'll tell you what i've just caught it on not bad game we haven't been here long i want to play with you but i'm on xbox oh no my friend Fair enough. Sub to Will and E is that. Please don't advertise the channels in the chat, guys. Come in, say hello first. Then I will shout you out. Right, guys. So the half lin. What did we have it on? That is the question. Let's have a look. So we caught that on the Atlantic Heat. The 15 mil Atlantic Heat on a Calder KD rig size 6. Awesome. Let's chuck this one back out. Where was that? It was over there, wasn't it? Let's get that one back out over there. Looks like they've changed the colours. Totally agree, my friend. Them colours are definitely different. I caught that fish yesterday or the day before when I'd done a video. Um, and that fish was a lot brighter in colour than that. It's definitely been sort of paled down as it was. Right, let's get this one out. Not sure what Rod Free's doing there, but I'll tell you what we'll do. We'll put Rod 2 down the middle here. Bug, I have you on PS. Can I join? Jake, this isn't in a multiplayer session at the moment, my friend. This is in single player for the purpose of the stream. Uh, number 3. So I apologise about that. Let's just plonk this one down here, I think. See if we can find a little silt spot down there. See, I would usually fish a chod. There we go. That will do nicely. Put that there. Right. Number one's line's gone slack. It does annoy me when the line goes slack on this game. I'm not quite sure why. I usually fish semi-slack lines when I'm actually fishing as well. But it does on here. Look, it's just gone slack again. I'm just going to leave that to go slack. The colours in the game look very different. The water colour looks different. The fish colours are definitely different. A lot of people want to play with you. Uh, they do, Adam. Sorry I'm late. Never got the notification. Max Johnson, welcome to the stream, my friend. Do you have time to play after the stream? I'm on PS4. I've got a feeling I'm going to be sorting out some dinner, my friend. But if I'm on later, then I'll let people join. For sure. I definitely... Um, I'm back at work tomorrow for four nights, um, but after that, I'll definitely try and do um, a subs, bugs and subs, how does that sound, uh, where we can get a couple of people in, that might be good, sorry man, have you got, but thanks for telling me the info, no worries, bug, have you had any boss fish on the new bait, yes, I've just had the half lean on the Atlantic Heat, think it was was it atlantic heat yes it was so i've got atlantic heat on rod one royal marine on rod two and tnt on rod three so tnt being toffee and tiger nut so that is awesome the lines have gone slack but i'm gonna leave them for a little while okay so this rod seems quite popular at the moment maybe i'll put all the rods on the same bait and we'll see what happens oh all three rods are going. Look at that. One come off straight away. That happens. You get hook pulls in real life. Uh, anyone that carp fishes knows that often we get our baits picked up and then dropped again. And these things do happen. Rod three is just sort of plundering around. This feels like a good fish. This doesn't feel uh, small. We'll just take our time with it, no problem. Enjoy the game, take your time. No big rush, just uh, get this in. 
How many people can join a session bug? You can only have up to four people, including which would be including myself. So three people, which is a little bit annoying. I'm not going to lie. I think they could kind of expand that to maybe eight would be really good. Eight people in a session would be awesome. Right, this fish is ready to come in. I didn't mean to net it, actually, then, but I wanted to have a look. Them fish colours are definitely different. Definitely. Right, 18 pounds. Let's get him back. We need to pick up Rod. Let's pick up Rod 2. Rod 3 looks like it's disappearing, but let's get Rod 2 in. Just give this one a little bit of stick. Oh. Rod 2 could have been a good choice. Gaining in a bit of line. 21. Come on. 21 yards right now. Quickest way to get TSP bug. TSP? Here we go. Quickest way to get TSP. What's TSP, guys? Inform me. I, I apologise. This feels like a decent fish, this one. I've got to be honest, guys. Hi, Big Timer. Thanks for the comments. That is awesome. Big Timer J could share my... Oh, oh. That looked like a boss tail to me. Trying to read comments and play fish. <laughs> I'm just the man. I can't multitask. <laughs> Here we go. Come on. Get in. That is... These fish have definitely been changed. I'm not sure about the scales on the top of the fish. They look like they're lifted, but still, I do love these new colours. £24.13, guys. Let's pick up that Rod 3, because Rod 3 is actually desperate to be caught on the top of it. Whoa! Where are you going? That's as mad as a box of frogs. Yeah, that wasn't very happy, that fish. I don't know what happened there. That was really strange. Is Fishing Planet coming to Xbox? Apparently so. I understand it is coming to Xbox soon. Really need this Platy Bruiser and Baby M. I've had Pac M and Half Lin. I've had them five, six times each, something like that. So I've had them a few times now, but I really just put a bit more pressure on this fish. See what it's going to do. Really want to catch these other fish. Might have to go stalking for them. Tackle shot points, no worries. Ian, I apologise if I'm missing any of your comments. I'm going on holiday to Poland, so after the stream, we can play Euro fishing. Anyone else who wants? Nice one. I'll be sorting out some dinner, no doubt. It's getting to that time of the day. This feels decent. This is really giving up a good fight. That £24 that I had was a really good fighting fish as well, as it happens. You just take our time. No rush. Just uh, plod along. Come on, in you come. Play the game. I want to have a picture. Oh, bit of line slack there. That looked like a shark. You see the fin come out. Wow, look at that. That is really pale. Again, looks similar to the other one. It's got the pale look and the, the little red fleck in the tail. I like it. Another 24 pounder. So that's a couple we've had. My name on Euro Fishing. Adam Kiop. Very nice. I finally caught Baby M Bug. Awesome, that's the one I'm after. Fishing Planet looks more complicated than Euro Fishing Bug. 
it definitely is more complicated Danny um, I've put a tutorial video up today uh, hopefully trying to teach people how to navigate the menus a lot of people were struggling with it um, so hopefully that will help out but it definitely is a lot more complicated um, it's going to be a grind that game going to have to put a lot of hours onto it I can't personally I really do like this game if I'm honest um, I can see the draw for uh, Fishing Planet but if I'm honest I like the way this game plays I, it just appeals to me what swim are you in? I am in the bottom right hand corner of the lake on digger lakes uh, it's the one where on the bottom right hand corner you've got two pegs there's one here and one next to me but I fish this swim here and then I can cover all this area I might move over I might chuck one down there actually we'll see what happens we'll see what happens is this the new pond no the new pond's not out yet stick uh, it'll be out soon Speak to you soon, Big Bug Laters. Thank you very much, Big Timer Joe, for tuning in. Much appreciated, my friend. Yo, how's it going, Bug? Fluffball. Yo, welcome, my friend. It's going well. Um, just a quick stream today. Try out these new baits. See what we think of them. And then uh, we'll go from there. Definitely. All right, awesome got me coffee I keep forgetting about me coffee two seconds guys I'll just mute this mic I'm sure you guys don't want to hear me slurping a coffee so I'll mute that out I've got a Hulk, very nice, that's a, one of the other fish that I'm after, I'm after the Hulk and Pink Belly from St John, then I've caught them all on there, uh, so that'd be really good, I only need Fat Boy from Preza to have all boss fish, very nice, that is good game my friend, well done, that is really good, uh, yeah, so the new pond, Manor Farm, not sure when it's coming out guys, if I'm honest, um, didn't really know a lot about it until some point yesterday when it was sort of popped up on the game. Uh, people were talking about it in the forums and things like that. Um, that's when I found out about it. We might have to have a move, guys. We might change, have a change of swim. We'll see what happens. Let's get the spod rod out. Now, when it goes quiet like this, I spod first, and if the spod doesn't work, then I start looking for different parts of the lake to fish. Run that in. Oh, a bit too close, but that'd be alright. What bait and which peg was you on? Oh, what, on this game? I'm on the bottom right hand corner of Digger Lake, and I'm using Atlantic Heat, TNT and Royal Marine. They're the new baits that have come out. Stick a little bit of bait on this one. Try and sort of cast past it and then wind back onto it if we can. Just like that. Give it a little wind. A little bit closer than I wanted. St John is the best for me. I never catch fish on the Spanish pond. Yeah, the Spanish ponds are tough tough pond to go on to be honest my advice would be go on there put three spots out and then cast your rods out onto it 20 mil tiger nuts and boilies are definitely the, the order of the day that would be my advice glitching mods menu clanks is that hi welcome my friend thank you for tuning in don't forget if you're uh, new around here maybe subscribe if you like what you see that'd be really good and uh, give us a thumbs up guys that helps us out no end just uh, updating the chat here we go I'm not 
the biggest fan of the French pond. Now, I'd say I've not fished the French pond or uh, the observatory very much, if I'm honest. Um, I'm not really interested in a lot of the boss fish on there. Maybe the bigger ones, but I, I will definitely go there at some point. But St. John's Lake's definitely probably my... Uh, no, St. John's Lake is my favourite lake. That and the foundry. I like the foundry. The foundry's been quite good to me, if I'm honest. Um, like I said, I've had all the boss fish off of there. St. John's, I just need two boss fish. Then we're done on that lake as well. Yes, we're away. Last, a little sort of little blank session there, weren't there? We weren't sort of hooking anything. Okay. Feels good. Come on, then you can. 21. I'm just watching the, the distance, see how much distance it can get on me, this fish. Give it a little, one more little crank. I like to keep my line tension quite high, guys, as you know. 21. Maybe not as big as I thought. I had a funny feeling just for a second this could be a boss fish. Doesn't seem that way now. Awesome. Just going to crank that tension down a little bit while it gets closer to me. Come on, in you come. In you come. Just in the lake and got over £20. Nice. Very nice. It's good game, my friend. That was the biggest fish you caught in your... What's the biggest fish you've caught in real life? I had a £32.5 Miracarp. Is my biggest. <clears throat> Not particularly massive, but a good size. Not to be sniffed at. Alright, he's ready. Is that upside down? I hope that was upside down. Oh, not quite. Fault very hard. Look at the size of the propeller on it. <laughs> Not surprised. £18.10. Look at the size of that tail. No wonder it fought so hard. Very nice. They definitely uh, sort of tweak the colours of the fish. Okay, let's go a little bit further over the back, I think. See if we can get in that little sort of gap over there. Um, okay, I'll leave that there if that's going to stay on the silt. That'd be awesome. Right, let's do the same with rod two. Let's put that into that back corner over there. I reckon that's about, what, 30, 35 yards? <laughs> Maybe less, 20, 30. Yep, I'll leave that one just there. And rod one. I'm going to stick rod one further around the corner, I think. I'm going to put it the other side of these lily beds. Now, see that sort of tree over there? I'm going to aim for that. I'll probably end up in the tree, if I'm honest. Slow it down. Just bring it back. Just went past the tree. I'm going to leave it there, just under that tree. That's perfect. I quite like that. That's a nice, uh, nice little area. I'm feeling confident with that rod over there. Let's put some spot over there, I think. So just the one boss fish so far. If you've just tuned in, we had the half lean. Uh, not, not quite hard enough, that. Uh, we've had the halfling a few times before. <clears throat> if you guys have watched the videos, you'll know that. Oh, a bit hard, that one. Let's bring that back. Here we go. A little bit more. Here we go. Perfect. That'll do. That'll do nicely. Just caught the Hulk. Very nice. I need one fish from Digger Lake. Let's see, I'm off the three. Just caught the hole. You find in these new baits take a while to work, but not getting any more nuisance fish. Yeah, they've done a patch so that 
when you're using the bigger fish, the smaller fish won't um, get in your way if you like. All right, we are away, guys. I was feeling confident about this rod sitting under that tree, if I'm honest. And it does feel like a decent fish. This this does feel pretty good. I've kind of a stalemate with it at 33 yards at the moment. The other two rods are going absolutely crazy. Right, we're sort of gaining some ground now. It's loosened up. Maybe like a 20 pound carp or something. coming in quite quickly now which is a concern I thought it just for a split second then I thought this is the this is a boss fish it definitely isn't oh I don't know though it's uh, maxing the line out under the rod <laughs> come on in you come got two more rods absolutely going crazy this is really fighting hard it's staying very deep this fish I don't usually right let's get rod three. I'll go for rod three because it's nearest the bank over there. When I was landing that I could just see out the corner of my eye. Alright. Free rod take. You find a new rod take blah, blah, blah. Are you gonna Are you gonna get the new NASCAR? Mm, good question. Not sure. Sure, I was a bit disappointed with NASCAR hate, if I'm honest. I love NASCAR, but I was a little bit disappointed, I've got to be honest. Let's see how we get on. I am going to bust the mood soon, guys. Um, got to sort out some dinner. A man's got to eat. But I definitely will do a live stream after my dinner, promise for sure. Um, I don't always do live streams, as you know, but I'm really enjoying this one and feel a bit, bit sad that I've got to end it to have my dinner. But if I don't eat, um, I'll, get, I'll get grumpy. <laughs> I'll get hangry. Right, nice. Let's get that one in. The other one came off. Look at that, that is an amazing colour scheme. That is probably the best colours I've seen on a fishing game, if I'm honest. Had Megalodon on, but got to 242 yards and came off. Dippy Doorknob, unlucky my friend. I've had that quite a few times myself. Yeah, was using TNT last night, had it out for 20 minutes and nothing, but had a decent mirror just after. They've definitely made the game a little harder, I think. Um, but I'm still catching sort of boss fish, so I'm not going to say it's impossibly hard or anything like that. Let's see what we got here. Get in the net. Another one. Look at that. Wow, they're really showing off with this new colour scheme. Right, okay. Now, let's set up. What's that? What rod was that down there? Was that two that's gone down there? Well, oh, right. Let's um, put this one back over the back there. Oh, maybe a little bit further out would help. I'm going to hop off, man. I'll talk to you later. Take care, Fluffball. Thank you for tuning in, my friend. Much appreciated. Don't forget to hit that like on the way out. That'd be really cool. Gello says hello there. Welcome, my friend. Welcome to the stream. Uh, this is a bit of a warm-up stream. Uh, we'll do a stream tonight, like I said. I'm going to cast this one a bit further. Sort of to the left of that tree if we can. Right, perfect. Yeah, that was kind of where we were fishing, wasn't it? So, let's leave it there. Uh, rod 3. Let's uh, mutilise that little spot over there again. Just by that bank. Bless you. 
My wife in the background sneezing, bless her. Alright, and what I'll do in a second is I'll probably change one of these baits to the good old pop-up and see if we can get something kind of pop-up in the actual lily beds, that's always a good one. Just bear with me guys, I'm just going to have a sip of my coffee. Okay, let's change rod two to a pop up. That's what I'm thinking. So if it's not working, change it, yeah? That seems to be the way to go. Let's go infantry. Uh, let's go weed rig. <coughs> High vis 15 mil pop up. Let's see what that does. I'm going to plunk this right in the middle of the lilies. Them ones or them ones? Uh, them ones, I think. Let's just plunk it out here. I'm going to go right in the middle. We're just going to wind that in so it's in the lilies. That's where we want to be. We'll see how we get on with that. These lines keep going slack. There we go. Tight lines. Oh, wrong rod. My bad. Uh, rod 3 we want. Right, rod 3. So this had the TNT on it. I thought we left the TNT off. What was the one we left off? Rod 1. I fancy rod 1 for a boss fish, if I'm honest. I don't know why. I've just got a feeling. Okay, let's see how we get on. Started well. Mm. Don't think it's a boss. Just start sort of pulling it towards us a bit. Might need to change the swim, guys. Yo, big man, I've hit that like. Thank you very much, Mr. Walters. Much appreciated. Welcome to the stream, buddy. Uh, we're trying out the new baits on Euro fishing. Here we go. I hope you've had a great day, my friend. I hope it all went well. Right, so Rod 2 now is uh, having a little tear off. So we'll try and get this one in as quick as we can. Come on, in you come. Yes, right. That's in catch mode. I'm going to put that down. Pick up Rod 2. Awesome. Now we are due another boss fish about now, I would say. So, it'd be nice if this is a boss fish. Just uh, sort of pull the rod back gently and reel it down. Feels okay. It doesn't really want to give up. Sort of holding out there at the 20 yards and coming in. What rod is this? This rod 2, isn't it? This was on the high vis pop up that I've just put on, so. And that was right in the middle of the lily pads. I'll catch back up later. I've got to go pick up my dinner. Kate? Nice. Laters. Take care, buddy. Thank you for tuning in. Much appreciated. I'm getting off. Talk to you later. Take care, Lane. Thank you very much for tuning in. Much appreciated. Hope this new lake is decent. Leighton Jones. Yeah, me too, my friend. We've just got to wait for it now. Once the new lake comes, that'll be absolutely awesome. And, uh, right, Rod 1. Let's see what's on Rod 1. I nearly forgot about it, guys. So let's just pull it back to waters. Here we go. It's not upside down. It's on its side. It looks like another one of those linears, if I'm honest. Oh, it's a common. Look at that. Nice colours. I do love these new colours. I've got to be honest. 
15 pound 14 ounces very nice I think the fish are too bright now this one isn't but the pale ones are I think I mean if we're gonna sort of say about fish colors and you know there's a good swim down on the bottom left about six canals go through same place yeah I might have a little chat do you know what guys let's have a little change up eh? let's put that down let's pack up let's go to the mat let's have a change of swim that's not a bad idea all right on your say so we'll go down to the bottom left I know the swim you're talking about uh, we'll have a sort of 10 minute fish in that swim see how we get on I do like, I'll tell you what actually, I quite like this swim round here, I'll show you. It's my turn to cook tonight, so um, I guess I'll be ordering a takeaway. <laughs> my cooking skills are not good. I'll probably burn the kitchen down if I'm honest. Is it this swim? I think it's here, the swim I'm thinking of. Yes it is. Awesome, right. This is a really good swim. I've fished this swim before, I've actually, I was looking for this swim the other day and I couldn't remember where it was. So right, rod one, I'm going to put just under that tree there, the one that hangs out. Um, I'm looking for sort of features, that's where we're going to go. Just bring it, that's it kind of feeling like there is a good place let's put that down rod two we'll just go sort of middle middle of this little canal i think i caught my first boss fish from this this swim when uh, i first played it 25 yards yeah we'll do that I'll tell you what we'll do, we'll cover all the routes for that side, so let's um it's like a little bay there, look, we could go to that. Right, let's go over towards that little tree if we can. So if we cannot hit the island, that'll be awesome. If not, we'll wind down onto the spot. Just slowing the reel down. Oh. Let's sort of hey, alright, calm down. It's having a bit of a moment. There we go. Bit further out than I wanted, if I'm honest. Look at that, that's really moving. I can't leave that there, that'll just annoy me. Let's put it a bit further down then. Let's go long. A bit longer. The mirrors are too pale. Yes, yeah, some of them definitely are latent. I do agree there. Just want to put this where it will settle. Might leave it down there, to be honest. Bit of a risk, but let's leave it there anyway. Let's get the old spod rod out. Let's see what we can do. I'm going to spod by rod one. Quite fancy rod one for our fish. Oh, now. I've not seen that happen for a while where you cast a spot out and it comes back at you. Nah, not that one. <laughs> That's it. Oh, it's, it's, the spot is bouncing back. So, hmm, let's try spot rod two. I'll go a little bit further. It only bounces back the spot when you're fishing quite close. There you go, look, it's bouncing back. Right, let's bounce back to where we want it. Uh, Stephanie Williams, what else was the update about other than new baits? I'll tell you what, I can tell you now. I can read it to you if you want. Let's have a look. Let me just find it on my pictures. 
Right, I've got the update list. Just give me a second. Let me get this fish. And um, I'll read it to you. So you have to give me a second, guys. I can't actually see the chat right now where I've... Whoa, 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 whoa. Calm down. This feels like a good fish. This feels like a good fish. I don't want to lose this one. So it's had four new baits added to the tackle shop. Uh, Royal Marine, TNT, Atlantic Heat and Liver Pro. I'm not used to Liver Pro yet. This feels like a really good fish. I don't want to lose this fish. Um, read. Readjusted fish AI to prevent fish from taking bait too big for them. So that the roach and things now shouldn't be taking bait from you. This feels like a really good fish guys. I'm not going to lie. Sorry about the... This is trying to head down that canal. No. Come back. Don't go down there. Don't. The other rod's going as well. Um, Yeah, so they've readjusted the size of the fish that you catch pending on the size of the bait. So obviously if you're using maggots, you'll probably catch roach or bream or tench even. But you shouldn't be. This is a really nice fish. I cannot budge this fish. Here we go. So they've implemented the server side loading screen. They fixed issues with baits rigs that would unrealistically bobble around. Although they are still moving a little bit. If I'm honest, this fish has give up really quick. I thought this was going to be a really good fish, but I'm not so sure now. Oh, don't go that way. Don't go that way. Don't want him in that bit next door. That would be a nightmare. Come on. He's in the eight yard dash. Look how he's bubbling around. He's fighting hard. Oh, wow. He's really tearing us up in this eight yard dash. Oh. Just bear with me, guys. I will get back to you guys and girls. Typical, I was just going to read it here. Come on. Just uh, bear with me chat. Let me just uh, try and sort this out. What's the very biggest you've had out of Digger? Um, I think it's Pack M was the biggest one. I'm after Baby M. This is a really good fish. This, if this isn't a boss, I'll be surprised. Let's have a look. I've got to land it straight away. The other one came off. Oh, wow. Look at the size of that. That's huge. That's got to be a boss, surely. Got to be a boss. Shoulders. 34 pound. Second boss fish of the live stream. Can't grumble at that. Very pale looking shoulders. He looks like he needs to catch some sun. But really, really pleased with that. So, second boss fish. We had the half limb. And now we've had shoulders. Let's get him back. Quickly pick up rod two. Rod 1 did snap off. I'll tell you what I had shoulders on in a second. Just bear with me. Look, this fish has put loads of line out. What are the new baits? Mad Max. Uh, the new baits are the Liver Pro flavour. Or scent. Or whatever you want to call it. Um, TNT, which is Toffee and Tiger Nut. Atlantic Heat, which is like a fish meal with spice. And Royal Marine, which again I think will be a fish meal based bait. Um, that's what we're using today. I think this number two's on a pop. I'm not sure what we're using because we moved swims, didn't we? We'll have a look in a second. We'll have a look in a second. I want to read the update notes for. Who was it that said it? Stephanie, uh, we're going to read them update notes in two seconds. I'm going to do that for you. Just bear with me. 
Dip it on up, shows what a change of swim does. That is very true, my friend. I've always said, if the swim dies off and you do a bit of spod and it doesn't pick up, then you've got to change swims. Um, I've always sort of maintained that. Come on. That fish fought hard. I'm not going to lie. That fish fought very hard. It's got to be a 20. What's that? 18 pound? Yeah, 18 pound 10. Look at the size of the rudder on it. That propeller's massive. Wow. Okay, let's have a look quickly what I caught them on. So, Atlantic Heat, 15 mil. A high vis pop up was the 18 pounder. And TNT 18 mil of the baits. Um, TNT was what we caught shoulders on, I believe. Right, guys, I'm going to quickly read these patch notes here, okay? So, this is what's been added. Four new baits have been added to the game Royal Marine, TNT, Atlantic Heat, and Liver Pro. Readjusted fish. Um, re adjusted fish AI to prevent fish from taking baits too big for them implement server side loading screens fixed issues with rig bait would unrealistically bobble after casting out fish issues in the challenge where score wasn't always awarded after hitting a target fixed issues regarding leaderboard navigation fixed various locations localization issues fixed academy crash so when it crashes in the academy uh, da, da, da. additional Xbox feature only features fix the crash in multiplayer fix the crash when disconnecting the controller in multiplayer fix fixed rich presence so that users can now see the game mode that other players are in via the friends list so if they're in multiplayer single player whatever fixed non xbox live gold membership pro uh, promotion so basically when the, the um you're in that game it will constantly pop up what you do you know membership gold and all that for you guys so obviously you guys have had enough of that right let's get these rods back out dead quick so rod three done as proud that's on the TNT, if that continued, that was right down there as well. So let's get that back down there. James Creek Gaming, yo, what's up? Take it easy, bud. Another great stream. Thank you, Fire Rat, for tuning in. Much appreciated, my friend. Stay safe. James Creek Gaming's in the house. Anybody, if you love your sim racing, James Creek Gaming is the man for you. You need to go check out his channel. Awesome uh, sim racer real good group that he runs as well if that's your thing then go tune into that man um they do have an open door policy as well as long as you race clean then they will accept you into their group which is on facebook for more details hit james creek gaming's channel let's get this one under the tree i hope you're keeping well james i'm missing you buddy i've not spoke to you for ages right last cast for these three rods guys before i order some dinner and uh have some dinner wait it was me your mic is a bit low how's that my friend is that a bit better i apologize about that yo it, it was me <laughs> all right <laughs> thanks buddy always a pleasure james not a problem right guys last cast for these three rods until after i've had my dinner then i promise to do another live stream um an absolute swear down promise to you guys. Project Cars 2. Yes, that is coming out very soon. Um, I, I do want to get it. It comes out in September, doesn't it? So, I do want to get it, but... I'm so bad at racing compared to you guys. You guys absolutely smash it. I'm terrible at it. We're into another fish. That is awesome. 26 yards. Is this going to be a boss? 27. A bit jerky, this fish. A bit nervous, I think. Don't be nervous. Come in. Don't forget to hit that like for us, guys. That would be really cool. 
Please bug do a video on new Lake Manor Lake when it comes. Yes, I definitely will be doing a Manor Farm. Without a doubt. As soon as that lands, I'll be doing that. You don't sound too sure. I, yeah, I'm... Do you know what, James? I, I haven't played a car game for a while. I'm a bit burnt out with them. But I probably will get it, to be fair. I know what I'm like. I'm, you know... But I'm having a bit of a funny one with a lot of games at the moment, if I'm honest. This fish is really fighting strange. Maybe it's like a Nemo fish. It's got one fin smaller than the other. It's really jerking around. 34 likes. Awesome. Thank you so much, my friend. Yeah, I, I am looking forward to Project Cars too. But I, the thing that puts me off with Project Cars is all the setups and... They went way too deep with the first one. And I'm worried they're going to do the same with the second one. We got it in. Wow. We got it to the net. Awesome. What sim racer? What sim racer? Oh, um, a simulation racing, my friend, is what that is. Uh, go check out. Click on James Creek Gaming's channel, Leighton Jones. And uh, you'll see exactly what sim racing is, my friend. Right, I did actually say I wasn't going to cast that back out, but I will. Because that seems to be working quite well. What bait was on that? I think that was the Atlantic Heat, wasn't it? I think when we come back for the second live stream, we will do St. John's. That's kind of what I'm feeling. Yes, Rod 3. This is on the TNT. Ah, oh, came off. Unlucky. Right, we'll leave that out there still. That was on the TNT, the Toffee and Tiger Nut. All right. Gonna have a slurp of my coffee in a second. My coffee's gone extremely cold, but it still tastes good. It's all good. Nah. Stick to your fishing. <laughs> I'm definitely better at fishing than I am at sim racing. That is a dead cert. Your channel is growing nice, man. 2K end of year. Wow. It is, it, to be honest, um, it's kind of caught me a bit by surprise, James, if I'm honest, mate. Um, I, I, can, I seem to be doing something right for once in my life. <laughs> but, you know, see what happens. Um, just please... Uh, I'm doing something people enjoy. That's really cool. Like I say, I could never do what you do, live streaming the sim racing, because I'm so bad at it. Uh, so I could never do that. I mean, I think the last race I done before, I ended up crashing out, and it all went a bit tits up. And So, yeah. But I will join you guys again, for sure. Maybe when Project Cars 2 comes out. When is that due out, that Project Cars 2? I will be sticking to the fishing on this channel though, guys. Don't be worrying about that. Feels decent. I knew under that tree, under that tree is a good little spot. Nice and slow. It's got a slow plod about it. Definitely, uh, I can one, say one thing for sure on this lake. It's definitely a carp. Although, I don't think it would uh, every now and again for them to throw a catfish in. That catches all by surprise, wouldn't it? Feels okay. Doesn't want to come in. It's in the eight-yard dash. Come on! You tried Fishing Planet? I've just put a video up today, uh, Leighton, of um, showing people how to navigate the menus because the menus are so complicated on it. Give over. Your channel is growing us. Give over. <laughs> You're, uh, I've had some right shit races lately, but I enjoy the racing and the banter. Yep, yeah, very true, my friend. It is a pucker group you got there, to be fair, James. Forgot that sim racer is just kids racing. No, not on James Creek Gaming's channel. It's not, my friend. They're adults at race. Right, guys. So... I'm going to end this live stream right here. Uh, I will be back later tonight. I've got to have something to eat. That is really important to me. I am starving. And I'm a big boy, so I need food. 
Um, thank you to everyone for tuning in. Thank you, Jones Creek Gaming. Thank you, everybody else that's tuned in. I really do appreciate your support and hitting that like for me. You guys are absolute stars. Anything you want to see on the channel uh, or on a fishing, put in a comment on one of my videos. I do um, answer all my comments, so no worries there. Don't forget to hit that like. If you're new around here, subscribe. Look after yourselves. Take care. Peace.